And now they're going to be going four wide. Let's everybody on the back straightaway. Let's stand up. Wave to these drivers. They'll be waving at you. Those parked on the back straightaway. Flash those lights. Honk those horns. Let's get ready on the front straightaway. Get that flash photography ready. Get out those cell phones. Get out those iPads, those pee pads, whatever kind of pads you got to record the moment. Let them see you. Let them hear you. Ladies and gentlemen, the cars and stars of the Durant Lane Chevrolet Dirt Lane Model Series. Wave at them. They're waving at you. The time has come to get the 2019 season underway with only an event like the Ice Bowl can deliver. The two front row cars must both be inside that VP Racing Lubricant starting box between the two white cones on the inside of turn four. Let's try it again. They approach the starting box. They're in it, they're on it. Looks like a good start, we're racing. Jaden Frame from the pole position trying to take the lead off of turn two. Corey Posey on the outside, the 35 car. Can't keep pace with the leader. It'll be Jaden Frame, lead lap number one, Jimmy Elliott. He'll be inside for second. Cruz Skinner on the move. Chris Skinner underneath Elliott to take second. So the 39 car back to third. Mike Hinn up to second. Mike Hinn up to third in the 69 car. Position still being exchanged back towards the middle of the pack. Lots of good action all around Talladega short track. Caution flag out. We got a spin in turn two. Spin in turn two brings out the caution flag. For the Dixie style double foul restart, Jimmy Elliott to his right in the third spot. Race leader Jaden Frame picks up the pace in turn four. Three flags out. We're racing. Aiden Frame still out in front. Jimmy Elliott gets around the outside of Cruz Skinner to take over second. on the speedway. Trouble in turn three or four. T.J. Britton hits the end of the pit wall. It's his ball game. He swings the bat. Green flags out. Oh, trouble between Skinner and Elliott on the front straightaway, but they sort it out. That almost was disaster for Jimmy Elliott as he and Skinner got together. They sorted it out. Jaden Frame continuing to lead with Elliott in second, Cruz Skinner and third, Shannon Davis fourth, and Todd Hurst has moved up to fifth. Tyler Hurst 
and car number 21. Ronnie Johnson still riding in the sixth position. Corey Posey running seven. Series Ice Bowl main event. Field's been given the one to go signal. Jaden Frame picks up the throttle. Green flag down. We're racing. Cruz Skinner gets the whole shot on the J39 as they battle for second. Jimmy Elliott trying to come back on the inside. Here they come off a of turn four. It'll be Cruz Skinner taking second. down to spin to keep from hitting the 21 of Tyler Hurst. They're in the gas. Green flags out. Skinner chose the outside of the 11 car. Elliott likes it. He'll go underneath Skinner to take the second spot. Posey. 
Shannon Davis back to the fifth spot. Braden Mitchell up to sixth. Steve Russell moves up into seventh. Eighth is the 25 car. Ronnie Johnson drops back to ninth. the biggest lead that he's had all night long. He's got about 12 car lengths now on Jimmy Elliott, the J39 with Chris Skinner in third. Corey Posey running in the fourth spot. Fifth is Shannon Davis. Braden Mitchell up to sixth. Walls and Russell battle side by side for seventh. Russell has the position. Ethan Walls back in the eighth spot, Ronnie Johnson ninth, Heath Carr in tenth. Chase Walls will drive underneath Steve Russell down the back straightaway to move up into that seventh spot. Now Ronnie Johnson challenging Russell. Boy, that's a phrase that you could have used back in the 80s a lot. Ronnie Johnson and Steve Russell, they've met. Three. 
Sunday car dance for the win. Less than three laps to go. Through turns one and two. Elliott will hold off frame one more time. Heavy lap traffic now in front of the leaders as they run two wide. Coming down with the two to go signal. Jimmy Elliott, he's protecting the bottom of the racetrack. If Jaden Frank's gonna make a move, he's gonna have to do it on the outside. So Jimmy Elliott, can, he is protecting that bottom white flag in the air. Here we go, last lap. Jimmy Elliott into turn number one, down on the bottom, Jaden Frame, no room there. Jimmy Elliott with two car lengths down the back straightaway into turn three. Elliott protects the bottom, brings it up a turn four. Jimmy Elliott takes the win, Jaden Frame second, third will go to Cruz Skinner, fourth will be Shannon Davis, fifth will be the 35 car of Corey Posey. Wow, what a race right down to the finish. And picking it up where he left off in 2018 with the Durrance Lane Chevrolet Dirt Lake Model Series Winter Shootout Series. He'll leave Talladega Short Track as the point leader with an ice bowl win. Coming home with that $3,000 check out of Cleveland, Tennessee, Jimmy Elliott. Jimmy, congratulations. Hey, man, I appreciate it. I mean, well, I got to thank my whole team. I mean, uh, I had a lot of, you know, help this weekend, and it took a lot off of me, and I want to thank my mom and dad. Uh, they always go with me racing. They couldn't make it this weekend. I just wish they was here, but hey, we pulled it off. You got something to show them when you get home with that big ice bowl trophy. Oh yeah, no doubt. They're tickled to death. They've already called me and tickled to death. I want to thank my wife for all the support. Uh, my kids, uh, it takes a lot of time and a lot of time away from home to do this. And I appreciate everything. All the help, Sean, Josh, uh, Chris, Seven, I mean, everybody that pitched in, I couldn't do it without them. Every, all my uh, supporters, uh, hopefully we can do a little bit more racing this year. Well, we've got six more races in this winter shootout. We're going to see you try to repeat as the champion? We're going to try to. Uh, we're going to run this. plan is now to run the winter series and uh, see where it goes from there, but definitely that. Uh, make sure we can go to Florida. If I can go to Florida, then I'll hit the other ones, but that's the plan as of right now. Well, round two's close by to your hometown of Cleveland, Tennessee, because on February the 15th and 16th, we'll be at the Winterfest at Duck River Raceway Park over in Wheel, Tennessee. Yeah, we plan on going there for sure. Uh, I mean, it's two hour drive to three hour drive for me, and that, you know, that's not bad for me. Main thing is if we can go to Florida and uh, winning this deal helps you know, it uh, takes so much money to go up and down the road, you know, so uh, anything, anytime you can get 3000 right here, it helps you go up and down the road. Let's talk a little bit about the race tonight. It, the track just seemed completely different, I think, than what a lot of people expected. It was real racy out there. They kind of threw a curveball at you, I guess, but you were out there battling with Jaden Frame for the lead back and forth all race long. Oh, yeah, no doubt. I mean, the racetrack uh, was actually more racier than what I thought it was going to be. Uh, we broke out running second, and we was just riding. And I, I thought the time was going to be in lap traffic, so uh, I took my chance. Caution come out then, and I was like, well, we probably gave it up then. But uh, we got in lap traffic, and he pushed, and we had to be there whenever it happened, and luckily we was there. Got to be in the right place at the right time, and he was tonight picking up the $3,000 win with the Durrance Lane Chevrolet Dirt Lane Model Series in round one of the winner shootout out of Cleveland, Tennessee. Jimmy Elliott, your winner tonight here at Talladega Short Track at the 28th Annual Ice Bowl.